Marina Manitowoc is out of service, and that's after it sounded during storms yesterday when it wasn't supposed to. Fox 11's Bill Miston has the facts. This siren outside Stangel Elementary was the source of alarm for some area residents Monday morning. Everything appears to be fine, but there's still no reason that the siren should have activated by itself. Manitowoc Fire Chief Todd Blazer says the siren, located on the city's northeast side, sounded twice between 6.30 and 6.45 a.m. The city's 10 sirens are tested every Saturday, but Blazer says Monday's sounding was not because of a test, an emergency, or severe weather. Should people be concerned if some severe weather moves in the area or any other type of emergency? No, no real concern whatsoever. Blazer says that's because the majority of the city's sirens overlap. However, police and fire will be told to take extra steps to notify the area in the event of an emergency. Those sirens are specifically for outdoor purposes. They're not meant to notify you inside your home. The county's emergency management director says there are several layers in addition to the sirens that are used to alert people in case of emergencies. Because there is no one perfect system. Director Nancy Crowley says that's why the county uses a special paging system between dispatchers and schools and an internet-based phone alert system. Crowley also urges people to purchase a weather radio. People unfortunately ignore all the methodology that we have in place. Both Crowley and Blazer say this mechanical malfunction can be used as a learning experience for the public to have an emergency plan in place. In Manitowoc, Bill Mistit, Fox 11 News. City electricians removed the sirens' electronic components and are sending the parts back to the manufacturer. Blazer says repairs should take about a week.